What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. As always, it is appreciated. Today's video is going to be relatively short, but uh, I still think it's something cool and I try putting out videos as much as I can that you know other people might want to do and that way they can see how to do it to their cars. So that's what we're going to do. I already got the lights up on the tree and my house for the season. But I also want to decorate one of my cars for Christmas. One, I like having the car out in front of the house for Christmas having lights. Two, if there's any meets or anything, or if I drive the car around town, people enjoy seeing it, and I just think it's really cool to do. So it has been two years since I've done this. Last time I did it, it was to the Q50 because my 350 was down. So this year, we're gonna go ahead and decorate my 350Z with lights. I think it's gonna look pretty good. Um, after that, I've already asked Jonathan, but we might end up shooting like a Christmas type like cinematic video. So that'll be also cool to see. But anyways, these are the types of lights that you wanna get. Basically, they're just battery powered Christmas lights. You can get them from Walmart or you can get them on Amazon. These first two that I had when I did the queue were from Walmart and these ones are from Amazon. As you can see, these lights are a little bigger uh, from Amazon actually, so might wanna go with those ones. But basically, they just take some batteries, you push the button, then they light up and they have like different modes that you can go through and things like that, so really cool. And if you're curious on how to actually get them to stick on the car, it's just gonna be these little suction cup clips. Just gotta make sure that they're the right ones because if you do the hook ones, it's not really gonna work, so they have to have like this opening here. But again, from Walmart or Amazon, I bought an extra pack from Amazon just because I wasn't sure if I had enough uh, to begin with. So that's pretty much all you need. Just stick these around your car in the shape that you want, run the lights throughout, and the car's decorated. Thought about doing um, wrapping paper too, but last time we did that on the Cube, 90% of it got messed up on the way home. Granted, I used like the Dollar Tree wrapping paper, I think, but it was still just like, it didn't hold whatsoever. So uh, this year, I'm not gonna do the wrapping paper. I'm gonna use the lights, and then I have a tiny Christmas tree that I might use for like the video or something like that, but we'll see. Either way, I'm gonna go ahead and take the uh, little sticky things and start putting them along the car with the design that I kinda wanna do. Okay, so got the first line of these little stickies all put on the car. Probably gonna run another set as I have four sets of different lights, uh, but I wanna see at least for starters how far the lights reach before I start just putting them all over the place. Also, when I did this on the Q50, I remember this being a lot easier. Um, half of them kept falling off, so I had to use some of the brand new ones that I bought. So they're a little mixed and matched, but I'm not sure if it's because of the cold or what's going on, but they aren't sticking as well as I'd like them to. Uh, so just know that if you are doing this, you're gonna have to mess with them a handful of times to make sure that they actually stick where you need them to. So pretty simple, you just follow the lines and you put the uh, lights through the clips. Honestly, the new clips that I bought hold the lights a little better than these ones. So uh, the link for these guys and the lights will be in the description uh, of this video. But I got these on Amazon and they're like perfectly made to hold these little strings. So definitely recommend getting these ones if you can. But I'm just gonna keep feeding the uh, Christmas lights throughout the car and then I'll pick the camera back up in a second. Okay, the lights are strung up on that side as well as this side. I also laid all the stickies on the top. Now I just have to run the lights through there and then it's pretty much done. All right, all four lights are on. Some of these stickies are still being a pain and popping off, so I'm gonna have to keep an eye on them um, to make sure and see if I need to order another packet. What's going on? Freaking one hanging off right there. But, uh, so that's a bit annoying. But all in all, pretty happy with how it looks. Obviously you can buy more of the lights for more intricate designs and things like that. So it's a couple days later right now. I'm just interrupting this vlog very briefly uh, to say that I did end up buying some more lights from when I originally filmed this and I made a couple of other small changes. So this string here uh, had a wire that was cut and just didn't look symmetrical from the other side. So I ended up just buying another pair of lights. And as you can see, I strung uh, one of them across the hood. Just made like this little design basically following the design the hood already has. And then with the other one, I ran it on the rear bumper so that the rear bumper also has some lights on it. Also, when I first did the lights, I kind of just taped the boxes, uh, one to the trunk and then the other set to the side of the car. And I thought it was gonna be fine, which technically it was, they didn't move, but one, it just didn't look good. Two, the tape was actually a huge pain uh, to peel off. I used tape instead of two-way tape because I thought it was gonna be easier and less damaging to my wrap, and honestly, it was possibly the opposite. So don't use the scotch tape. Just use like the thin strips of double-sided tape, you'll be fine. But anyways, um, I wanted to make sure that the boxes were hidden to have a more clean look. 
So boxes one and two for the sides, I just put underneath my louvers. If you don't have louvers on your car, don't worry about it. I'll still show you what to do with them, which is basically what I did with the rear bumper and just make the design go and flow into the trunk and just tape the box on the inside of the trunk. As for the hood one, I just put underneath the hood, pretty simple. The side ones were a little trickier. Luckily though, I have this space in between my Rocket Bunny fender and my actual fender. So I just put the boxes inside there and it actually works out pretty good. Only two downsides. One, I kind of have to air up to be able to actually turn them on and off. And two, when it's wet outside like it is today and you're driving, it's just kind of splashing water on the boxes. But I think they're sealed relatively well for the most part. I just wouldn't go too crazy with it. But uh, definitely trying to hide the boxes looks a little better. With that being said, let's go back a couple days to the original video I was filming. So up to you on what you want to use there. But uh, my sons want to turn it on, so we'll go ahead and turn it on. Here she is, all finished. So again, I think this is a really cool idea uh, to do to anybody's car for the holidays. It's relatively cheap, doesn't cost much at all. It takes maybe an hour to get all the stickies and the lights and everything put up, honestly not bad at all. But I think it looks really good, especially from the sides. Definitely recommend you guys doing it as well. And just as an added little bonus, here's what my house is looking like. I'm super happy with my house too. Before we always did like these icicle lights throughout the top, but for me, like the multicolor lights just scream Christmas and for once I wasn't broke this year and decided to buy the lights that I've always wanted for my house so I was super happy that I was able to buy these and like just between that, my cars, everything, just a uh, surreal feeling, I'm just really blessed. Sorry, no, this is besides the point of this video, especially if you guys are new to my channel, I apologize. Just for Thanksgiving, you know, being yesterday and Christmas coming up, just wanted to say I'm thankful so either way I appreciate you guys for watching checking this out uh, all this stuff will be in the description below if you want to do this to your own car hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed already and in case I don't see you guys before then hope you guys have a Merry Christmas peace out